to see just the joy in his face when he was running it was really heartwarming and, and um, very exciting to see. Yeah. Enzo was brought originally to our care and rehabilitation center in Maryland with quite a number of other dogs. I had decided that we would adopt one of them. I first met him over the phone when Jess, my colleague, picked him out. He legit parked up when you started when he saw you and you started talking. Oh my god, he's perfect. We sent all the other dogs to placement and they were just holding him until my friend could come and pick him up and so yeah, he got very spoiled. So we are out front of my friend's house. She had picked up Enzo for me this week, and I am waiting to meet him for the first time. I hear a little roll. Oh my god, oh, he's so tiny. I thought he was going to be bigger. Come here. Hello. Now our family, um, we're not, you know, to be honest, huge puppy people. <laughs> he's a good boy. It's just the numbers of dogs, it was just so staggering and this is just a, such a huge operation for us and we really wanted to be able to give back and take in one of these dogs and give them the life that they deserved. So we decided, okay, let's try a puppy. <laughs> Yeah, today we're flying him back to uh, Nevada, you know, be a Las Vegas dog with us and our family. Beagles are really big sniffers, and so I just can't imagine like being in one cage for so long without that ability to explore is like so antithetical for beagles in particular. And now he gets to go smell all the smells that he wants and explore, and I'm excited to just see him to continue to get those new experiences. And so. You know, in this job, it can be really difficult. It can be hard emotionally, it can be hard physically. You know, we have long days, long hours, hot days, cold days, wet days, and, you know, Enzo will always be a reminder of why I do the work that I do and what we're fighting for. I don't think he remembers anything of his past. He seems quite well-adjusted and quite, quite content and really just a happy, happy guy. We've just really been enjoying our time with him.